What's up, gang? It's Elliot Twist, and this is our top five this week. Congratulations to Omar Brown for managing to score a million views for Achilles' video. The video was panned on social media by local self-proclaimed critics. However, this did not stop it from crossing the million mark on YouTube. Way to go, Amara. The legend Thomas Mapuma was in the capital recently and put up an amazing performance at the Glamis Arena. His performance went on for about four hours. It lived up to the hype and left revelers fully satisfied. In fact, some people felt it was underpriced given how magical the entire experience was. Big shout out to Entertainment Republic for putting it together. Congratulations to Mukumba for being inducted into the Afro Pop Hall of Fame. The induction will be happening in New York City at the 30th Afro Pop anniversary. Mukomba joins a long list of Hall of Famers such as Oliver Mtukuti, Thomas Mapumo, Yusuf Ndo, Angelique Kijo, and many others. Inductees are normally celebrated for being able to connect America to Africa through their music. It's official! The growing of marijuana has been legalized in Zimbabwe. According to an article in the States Press, The Herald, the marijuana will be grown purely for medicinal purposes and all those wishing to grow it will need a permit from the Minister of Health, Dr. Parinyatwa. The permit is expected to last for five years. Whether this is a political move or not remains to be seen, however the fact is tobacco is fast losing its popularity on the global market and this development could generate much needed foreign currency, jobs and boost tourism, especially if it is allowed for recreational use. American retail giant Walmart has filed a patent for drone bees. Research indicates that the population of bees is fast declining and in a bid to beat this phenomenon, Walmart has opted to develop the drone bees so as to help in the pollination process of the produce they sell in their stores. Reminds me of that episode in Black Mirror of the killer drone bees. Hope it doesn't come to that. So for these and more stories, be sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram at The Juice, or visit our website, thejuice.co.zw.